hi friends so today we are reviewing Tito's salsa um, they are a company in Texas and they have sent me three of their salsas the Verde the Rojo and the Diablo so naturally I picked the spiciest one first to try so today we're doing the Diablo so let's see what's in it we got Roma tomatoes poblano peppers serrano peppers habaneros onions garlic extra virgin olive oil and sea salt pretty simple and that's what i look for in a salsa i don't really want a lot going on in there so i'm really excited so i got a few things i have a chorizo sopas and i also got some tortilla chips and in the background i have some fried plantains in case it gets too hot all right so let's try it with my johnny spoon first it's pretty thick in consistency. It's kind of like a paste, um, but that's not a bad thing. You get to try more of the ingredients that way, I think. Um, so let's see. So right away you get the tomatoes and there's chunks of garlic in there, which I love, I love, love, love garlic. Um, and that habanero packs some serious heat. My mouth is burning up. And I'm sure the more I have, the more on fire my mouth will be. So let's try it with some food. Whew. Yep, that heat is building. Really good with some tortilla chips, but due to its thicker consistency, I'd probably pair it with food over tortilla chips but it's not a bad combination. Yeah, that's spicy. That's really spicy. All right, let's put some on the sofas. Probably gonna put a little crema on there because my mouth is burning up. I'm surprised there's not um, a citrus factor in here. They could probably benefit from some lemon, but it's still pretty good without it. Yeah, that's good. I was right about pairing it with food because of that thick consistency. That's really good. Wow. This is honestly probably the spiciest salsa I've had. I usually want a really spicy salsa. I think the closest I've come to is the ghost pepper salsa at Trader Joe's. So this tops that. Definitely buying this again. Heat rating, I would give it a 9 out of 10. Um, my mouth is on fire, my lips are burning, my nose is starting to run, and I'm burning up. So. 9 out of 10 for the heat. Um, taste rating, I think I'm going to give it also a 9 out of 10. I think it would benefit from a little bit of citrus, but it is still really good. So they are still pretty new to the game. Um, they don't have a website, so you would have to DM him directly to get an order. But I'm telling you people, it's worth it. I am on Instagram. His handle is Tito underscore experience. Um, I've also tagged him below. So please check it out um try their sauces out i'm really excited to try the other two i will do video reviews of those as well so stay tuned and thank you for watching